Alright guys, so as you can see on screen right now, Fortnite have literally just dropped a blog post about a new Season 8 competitive details, and if we actually click on the blog post itself guys and give it a read, you'll see that there's some pretty interesting stuff coming to the game and coming to Arena. Now in this blog post guys, it does talk about a bunch of different things like um, FNCS Season 8, etc. But in this video today, I just want to focus on the Arena changes because those, in my opinion, are very interesting and it's something I just want to talk about i'll save the other stuff for later but getting straight into it guys the first thing that's mentioned about arena is the season 8 arena pre-season and fortnite say the following they say we will continue the arena pre-season in season 8 we will be monitoring new items and features and re-evaluating already existing items that may come back into the competitive loop pool arena hype will carry over from season 7 and will reset on uh, september the 20th to give players a chance to test out and play the new seasonal changes in a mean and way. We're also adding a pre-season warm-up test tournament which will simulate a single FNCS qualifier weekend on September the 24th to September the 26th and that right there is pretty interesting. So guys we will be seeing a pre-season coming into season 8 and that is pretty good to know. But moving on guys this is the most interesting part in my opinion. It's the changes that are actually going to be happening to Arena itself. Fortnite say this they say we noticed the changes we made to the scoring system last season allowed players to get to Champions League even faster than before. With Champions League as a qualification metric to most of our competitive events, we want to make the achievement hold more value. We'll be making more adjustments this season to make it more challenging to get to Champions League so quickly. We can't point to a date just yet, but our intentions is to explore a fill option for Arena at a later point in Season 8. Once this test goes live, we'll let you know. And that right there, guys, is the crazy, amazing information that I wanted to let you all know about. Out. For one, they're going to be making the Champions League a lot harder to get to because I agree with that like massively. Once you get to like Champions Division, which is relatively easy for the average player, like you can derank and you actually won't derank from the like Champions League in itself. Like you can go to zero points and you'll still be in Champions League. So yeah, Fortnite are right here, but literally it's super quick to get to and it doesn't really have any value to like get there and to sort of maintain it. So to see them adding more value to it and make it more like of an achievement, I think that is really good to know and i'm really happy about that upcoming change and then in addition to that guys we also will be getting a fill option in arena at some point so if you guys don't have any of your friends online don't have any friends at all you'll be able to play arena with a fill may that be in squads trios duos or whatever you will be all good to go and yeah guys that's just a few things out of this blog post that i wanted to mention in this video i'll be sure to leave the blog post in the description below so you guys can check it out for yourselves it's pretty interesting it has a bunch of information you guys need to read and again i'll leave it below that's all from me today guys thanks for watching peace